Hi, this is Chris Hanenberg from Serious Squash, and this is episode two of the Serious Squash Patreon account. Uh, what we're gonna do today is build off of episode one. Episode one, we were looking at the ready position on the tee, and from that ready position, now we're gonna look into the split step. Okay, so now you're really looking at my feet, um, and what we're gonna focus on is starting off split stepping to one side. Okay, so if I wanna move to the right side of the court, I actually split off my left foot. So I, I go slightly up, my left foot pushes out, and then I take that step on the right. If I move to the left side of the court, I have that little spring, right foot goes out first, and push this way. And the same idea if I'm gonna move to either of the corners. If I move to the front right, I'm gonna split backwards, so my left foot is actually going to hit down first. If I'm moving to the back right, slightly pushing off that left toe again, okay? But I'm not just coming up and straight down, I'm actually splitting, landing on one, two, right? Or to the front right again, this way. If I'm moving to the, to the left front, push back off the right foot, like this. If I'm moving to the back left, that little split. Um, I see most people only wanting to step off the tee, or they only split one way, and they're always going to split no matter where they're going on the court with that one foot. So make sure you get comfortable splitting this way, that way, right? That's what good movers are going to be, right? They're going to have that good first explosive first step. So that's it for episode two on the split step. I hope you learned a few things and enjoyed it, and you'll join me next week for episode three.